What's going on, guys? So, Zach got frustrated. I did this. Did the butterflies. I even tried the lightning a little bit. And Zach got frustrated. So guess what? Now we all magically have sigils. Don't question it. <laughs> uh. What? I beat her. You're sup. I beat her in the freaking race. What are you doing? Hang on. After winning the race. I beat her like 80 times. I have a freaking record of time of 13 seconds. You're supposed to get out of my way. Hang on. Let me beat her again, real quick. Because it says, um, race and defeat the Chocobo trainer in the Calm Lands. After winning the race, go up there and the guy moving will have, will be gone. And as you can see, I have beat her because instead of 45 second time, I have to be 13 or whatever. So whatever, we'll try and beat my time, which is not possible, but whatever. Because this game literally ticks me off like no other. I dodge more balloons than I do cho do birds. It's ridiculous. Not to mention my controllers, my D-pad's broken, so my chocobo is constantly curving left. Against my own will. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I can't even move. He's still hitting me. This is how pissed off I get at this stupid ass minigame. Look at that. Curving. Dick. I really have not the slightest clue, because I have a time of 13 seconds, but for some stupid reason, this guy's not moving. But, um, I think we can go get the other, th other stuff. Oh, okay, good, I just had to update it. Alright, who else do we have to pick up? I will play Blitzball because I need to get that for the world champion. I did get that, so... What do we pick up Lulu's weapon? I knew there was something underneath the water where you get the, um... Where you fight that giant fish where we got Anima. You remember that? I knew there was a chest down there. That's where you get Lulu's um, uncharged celestial weapon. So why don't we go grab that, huh? Yeah, I do sound very angry right now. I know. I know someone's saying, hey, you sound mad. Yeah. That's because the stupid freaking challenges tick me off in this game. This should be like my new game plus 99 because it maxes out or something. And it should just You're give me enough. those things. The amount of times I've had to do that stupid minigame. And I still suck at it. Probably because I don't play it 99 times in a row. But whatever. Whatever. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> what was that noise? That was me being weird. I'm having orange chicken. You guys want some? You sure? It's good. Yeah? Alright, man. I shall share with you. Should be a small little area in here, maybe? It's not very specific on where it is.
It says the southern part, that's all. Maybe I'm blind, who knows. Haha, -ha, you butthole. I knew they'd do something like that. Dang you, Square Enix. Hiding crap. Not allowing me to turn my camera to see said crap. Alright. Well, for the Spirit Lands, we gotta go to the Thunder Plains. And um, I've already, like I said, when I was in the Thunder Plains the first time, I activated all the Cactar Stones. Well, now, now that they're all activated, I just have to follow the Cactar Spirit. We're counting on you. Who's in the southern part. So instead of going straight to the Thunder Plains, I think it'd be a little bit easier to go to Guadalajalam. And then after that, wait, can I actually get the world champion? No, I have to get it from the person in the Luca Cafe who is the previous owner of the world champion ball. And uh, this is just going to be a quick video of me picking all this stuff up and enchanting it. And then I'm going to get back to capturing everything. My one love in this game. Capturing monsters. Uh, oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. Where are we going? Ah! You cheat. Alright, we gotta keep up with him. Where are we going? Right here? Where are we going? I have to follow you. Why are you making... Oh, it's over here, I bet. Do I have to go around this side, maybe? There we go. You just gotta push square on this thing. Because this is where he's trying to lead me to. And then that happens. We should get Kimari's blah blah blah. Pardon me. <laughs> hey Kimari. Got you something. By the way, these legendary weapons not only have the abilities on them. Holy crap. Nice. But they also have, um. A special. Like Titus's Kaladbalg? has the ability where it does more damage the higher Titus's health is. I push Dex, you bum. I push Dex! I preed the fifth! Preed it. Alright. Now, let us get aboard the airship. Bring me my boogie board. We're then you have my permission to surf. What does that mean? Well, that is a joke. Only me and my buds know. Sorry. Here we go. Sorry. Hmm. Then like a little orange chicken for the soul. And the stomach. It's delicious, right? Okay, so what do we have right now? We have Titus's weapon, Kimari's weapon, and Lulu's weapon. But you know what's sad? Lulu's weapon isn't a Moogle. So we're not equipping it. Because it's not a Moogle! <clears throat> Actually, we'll probably equip it. Nah, nah. Moogles are way better. To the Macarani of Forest, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is going to be a very short episode, holy buckets. Next episode, we're probably going to go fight bosses, I think. Mm, actually, next episode may or may not be... It's either going to be bosses, or it's going to be Blitzball episodes. 
we're getting close to the end, though. Not too many more episodes. Because once I finish capturing everything, I'm going to be able to make some good armor, spend some time at the monster arena. I'm still deciding whether or not I want to record that. And, um, aside from the monster arena, I'd like to go kill the Omega weapon and the Ultima weapon. Um... <sighs> I gotta make sure I have enough money to bribe the Ultima weapon. Because he gives you 99 pendulums, which are good for something. Aside from that, I also have, um, I'm gonna bribe a couple other things, because I'd like to have auto-haste on my, on my good armor, but, uh, yeah. And my next goal, see, Kimari. Aside from that, my main goal right now is to get Titus to be, Titus, Riku, and Kimari to be maxed out. That would be most good, Jonathan. I wonder what Kimari's, um, legendary... Well, obviously we're gonna look, so... But I haven't checked it in a while. I think that'd be kind of cool. His is gonna have nothing to do with magic, which is gonna suck for me. It's gonna have, like, counterattack, and he's gonna be like, Oh, you wanna hit me? <sighs> Nine damage. Take a victory in the your face a hole, boy. We just have Lulu... Roo -roo. Look at the onion knight! Oh my goodness! He's so tiny! Yeah. His is probably gonna be 1 MP cost. Something. I don't know. We'll, we'll find out. So yeah, make money, get strong, capture all the monsters, finish a blitz ball season. Um, kill a couple bosses, and that's really all that's on my list before we uh, end the game, which should be two episodes, I think. Alright, let's check out the new weapons. So, Kaladbog, where are you at? Break damage limit, evade and counter, and magic counter. So basically, his evade gets really high when someone melee attacks me. And he counters every magic attack. He's got triple overdrive. So I am going to need to get him a triple AP weapon for training. I've already se We've already seen hers. His is double AP, evade and counter. Yeah, he does have evade and counter. Oh, that's going to be really sad. I might have to put him through Orin's grid or something to get his strength up. Um, we've already checked out hers. Let's break damage limit, triple overdrive, magic booster, and one MP cost. So everything costs two MP, I believe, for her, but she does double damage, which is sick. His is already equipped, and we gotta get yours still, buddy. So, um, yeah. Really short episode, but, um, just wanted to show you guys that I did end up raging. I did end up magically getting all of those things. I should say, I did get the butterflies, but, you know. Chocobos really tick me off. And the lightning really ticks me off. <sighs> anyway, next episode, Zack Monster will be a lot happier. As well as being a lot more prepared for whatever we do then. So till next time, I'll see you.